Alright, I'm Master Martin and Mage. Welcome to episode 2 of Star Wars Battlefront. This will be my first, uh, space mission. I... It's looking like I won't be able to save while recording either, but fortunately the 1.3 patch, or either that, or... Something I download comes with a handy mission selector that allows me to jump directly to any mission, so I'll probably be doing that. Um, well, there's no particular rush on this mission, so let's just hop right in. Uh, well, first, the, the main difference between the clone marine and the clone pilot are that, that the co clone marine is sl slightly better armed for, well, arguably better armed for fighting within the big hangars or launch ships, whereas the pilot, while it doesn't have quite as good arms, the pistol is significantly worse than the rifle, most notably. It, they do, uh, any spaceship they're in has a regen factor. As you can see, both sides have unlimited resources re for this mission. So, I might derp around a bit, just because I can. Only the basic fighters are available for this mission. Incoming fighters, take them out. Oh, I do not have... I, I am... Hang on. The internet is probably going to yell at me for this, but... I'm not going to have the axes inverted. I just can't. Uh... What am I doing? Destroying fighters. Go figure. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, ow. Boost, boost away. Boost away from the auto turrets. Oh, there's a guy. What's lock on? I don't real. it's... That's always a very good thing in space combat. Uh, lock on, lock on. Primary attack, lock, lock, target, Q. So that will allow me to track him as I kill him. Poof! And then I can keep using that to find new targets. Eat missiles. No! Don't you dare! Ow! Rude! Okay. That was not genius, but... Okay. Uh... Hey, oi, oi! Oh, do you think you are? That was the worst Scottish accent ever. Like, why did I do that. I bet you couldn't tell that was supposed to be Scottish. I bet I couldn't tell that that was supposed to be Scottish. It's just like, boy, that came out slightly Scottish. Yeah, I should stop. I am totally distracting myself by doing bad accents, and it's great. This is how all games should be played. Okay. Oi! Oi! <laughs> I am normally better at this space combat than this. Then again, there is a reason why I almost always uh, opt to use the bombers over the normal fighters or the scouty things. Alright, now we're getting into something akin to the hang of things. 
or dying again. That works too. This should not be hard. I don't know why I'm making it hard. Fortunately, incompetence is not a way to lose this mission, so that's a win. Okay, we need to kill this thing. Oi! Missiles! That incoming missile notification, always a fairly good thing to look out for. Oh, hey, we won. Pilots, focus your fire on the main CIS ships. We need their shields down as quickly as possible. Stupid, 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 stupid. Okay, back to it. Insert some like pop song that I think has something to do with getting back up, but I don't actually know because I don't listen to that music. Yeah, that. Whatever you just started yelling at your screen. We'll call that what I was talking about. Ow! Sub, sub, sub. I will admit that I am pretty definitely used to playing a bomber where I can just like fly up to big cruisers and not die. Where I don't really have to watch the fact that I'm taking damage so much as how much damage I'm taking. Gotta run. Take down the droid communications array. That'll give you an opening. Check out that landing party. Or I could just, you know, go in there and skip this. Well done. Now that they're in disarray, fly into their hangar and I like how my allies are doing like most of the work for me. It's fantastic. Check out that well, time to show you guys pistol fighting. Or how to like fail a landing and blow up. Okay. Let's see if we can get there without the regen. Because blaster rifles are useful things. That being said, it will be kind of hard to get there without the regen since I don't have any bombers to take. Bombers have uh, significantly higher armor, as well as, you know, higher order explosives. So that's why I keep rambling about them. Okay. Much better. time bombs to destroy the internal systems. Ah, darn it. Okay. These droids are pretty useful things, by the way. Okay. Need to get their main defense array offline, although I'm never entirely sure what that does. Poof. Because it doesn't seem to like actually deactivate there. The auto turret defenses have been disabled. 
Well, I guess it's like external auto turrets. Because it certainly doesn't disable the ones that are shooting at me. Ow! Rat. Okay, I'm gonna just take a time bomb to it. Or 12. Or like, no, like 3. I don't have bombers. No one has bombers. Shut them out of the, the, the bombers. No! Ah! Okay. Down once more. Control to pilots. Prep your ships for battle. Yes, I know. I do make that particular Phantom of the Opera reference a lot. But everything is fine. K. K. Come on! Okay, what if we do it like this? And you don't know what this means, because I haven't done it yet. But I will do it, unless it, I just die instead. Which is always a possibility! <laughs> Insert obvious joke. Oh, come on! Hug the edge. Be a sneaky sneak. Now you gotta rotate here. I was wanting to plant the time bomb on the thing so that they could fly away and explode, but that didn't work. Wait for it. Poof! <laughs> I love doing that so much. Ah, darn it. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have wasted so much time. Oh well. Let's uh, get back on task. Watching them just fly into, off into space and then immediately explode is just way too satisfying to pass up though. Poof. In the sky. Poof. Yeah, you better run. Incidentally, you unfortunately cannot, uh, use the ship's weapons while in a hangar. Because that would be awesome to just fly in and wreck them by... Now get the medical oh, droid. 
Dodge roll. Dodge roll. Okay, I kind of used up all my rockets, so I should probably need to refill on those. Yes, every random person I'm killing is completely necessary. Why do you ask? Oh, no you don't! You'll never catch me! Poof. That was not a waste of a rocket in any way whatsoever. Also, I am about to die. Oh, there you are. I was wondering where you went. For the record, once I uh, finally destroy this thing, the mission will be over, so uh, getting on that might be a good idea before I have a like 40 minute episode on the second mission in the game, which is easy. I mean, I could beat this thing on Xbox, it's so easy. I promise you I'm good at this game. Well, okay at this game. Adequate at this game. We'll call it adequate. Just as I mentioned, I play things I'm good at, which includes not things that die in like two hits. Okay, let's try. Let's just get in there and blow it up with time bombs. That sound good? Stop it! Okay. This is probably not the best way to kill it. Let's just throw down a time bomb and leave. Actually, I think I need to take a droid ship, maybe. The enemy oh, I have to destroy the bridge. That would do it. That's not the right way. I'm lost! Out! I could take my fighter back, but why would I do that? Let's just gun this guy down. And steal his ship. Oh gosh, I'm about to die already. Ow! Get him! Down! I died. Stupid auto turrets. I should have gone through with my plan of taking the defense grid down again. Oh well. Just because I have a good idea doesn't mean I'm going to do that good idea. Targeting control. Doesn't matter. Like 
Republic is well on its way to victory. Your missiles don't matter. I win. I died a lot. Way more than I should. It was great. After disabling the final capital ship, General Kenobians. You know how Star Wars goes, don't you? Yep. 2916 KDR. Brilliant. I will see you in episode 3, in which I... What do I do? Is it something to do with... Bye!